What is up guys, I'm Daddy Gamer Fred back again with another Pokemon Ultra Sun and Pokemon Ultra Moon news update video. Today is February 27, 2018 and yesterday we got hit with the news of the brand new 2018 International Challenge of March. So let's dive into the official Pokemon website and see what this online competition is going to bring upon us for March. It says the next international challenge of 2018 is on the way, promising even more exciting battles under the 2018 Champion Series format. In the 2018 International Challenge of March, Pokemon throughout the national decks, excluding mythical Pokemon and some legendary Pokemon, are permitted in battle. Put together your best team and shoot for the top of the leaderboards. So this is pretty cool. We're getting the uh, complete national decks again, excluding mythical Pokemon and some legendary Pokemon. So again, the moves and the, the Pokemon we can actually pull from is going to be the biggest we can ever do. I'm excited, like always, to you know try to pull together a team and head online and probably get my head cut off. But at the same time, it's pretty exciting to go through this as always. It's a learning experience for me. Let me know in the comments the teams that you're going to probably be rolling with. I know national decks is huge, so you can literally pull out the gamut, the stops, the legendaries, well, some legendaries. The moves in the, the, the Pokemon you can do is literally endless. I'm curious to what we're gonna actually see. It says the competition features double battles with teams of six Pokemon, which four will participate in each match. Pokemon brought in via transporter are not permitted. See the complete regulations for a complete list of eligible Pokemon. All Pokemon will be set to level 54 the duration of the battles. There are gonna be no item restrictions except that no duplicate items are loud there will be a five minute player clock in a 45 second on turn again pretty standard stuff with the time with the five minutes and 45 second turns no duplicate items we always see that it kind of does make sense you don't want people spending like leftovers or whatever and the question thing is that no pokemon brought in via pokemon transporter are permitted which means that you wouldn't have to catch the pokemon within pokemon ultra sun or ultra moon in order to use use them or had breed them inside of Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon in order to use them. It does exclude a couple Pokemon, which is kind of weird. Again, it, it excludes unknown because unknown is uncatchable and unbreedable inside of Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon. But besides that, I do think the gamut is open. I do think besides legendaries and, you know, some mythical Pokemon, you literally can bring in tons of Pokemon into this online competition, even with not bringing them via transporter. So it says the top players in each age division will receive championship points which contribute towards the chances of earning an invitation to the Pokemon World Championship. Players must be opt-in to the Play Pokemon program and have a player ID at the time the competition begins to be eligible for championship points. All qualifying competitors will earn 50 battle points, which to me is the reason why I'm entering 50 battle points. It does help me uh, along the way of 100% in completing Pokemon Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon. And yes, I do count getting all the items, as silly as that sounds, as 100% completion. It says registration for the 2018 International Challenge of March begins Thursday, March 15th, 2018. And yes, I will be shooting a video March 15th to show you how to register it is pretty simple pretty basic but i always do videos on that and i'm going to continue in the future so you want to be subscribed ring the, the bell as well so you can be notified on when the registration opens up for this online competition for march it says the competition goes from Friday, March 23rd until Sunday, March 25th. Trainers will be limited to 15 battles per day. Juniors and senior division players born on 2003 or later are limited to playing between 6 a.m. to 11 p.m. based on the easternmost time zone in each player's country. Kind of the same basic thing that we always see. If you are, I believe, under the age of 16, you have to play in between 6 a.m. to 11 p.m. at the same time you have to you get separated from the seniors who are playing the people who are over that age who get put in a different bracket and doesn't have that time restraint this is all trainers will need a pokemon trainer club account a wireless internet connection 
their own copy of Pokemon Ultra Sun or Pokemon Ultra Moon video game with a party of eligible Pokemon. See the competition regulations for more details. Good luck, trainers. I think this is pretty good. Again, it's kind of basic stuff as we look into other international challenges for, I believe, January. We had the last one and we got the same thing. There was champion points given away. There were battle points given away. Same kind of deal going on here. I kind of, again, I always bring this up. I kind of wish that we were getting something like Mega Zones or some, something to alleviate, you know, actually grinding in the game to getting it, but I don't mind. Battle points are fine because I get to choose which Mega Stones that we actually, I get to purchase or whatever to get in the game, to use in the game. But with a game like Pokemon Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon, it's quite easy to grind for battle points. So that's not even a huge issue. But let me know your thoughts on the 2018 International Challenge for March. I think it's pretty cool. I'm gonna be down, as you guys know, I'm gonna be streaming my battles on Instagram, on my Instagram stories. In hell, if I have my setup set up in March, I will be streaming the battles on YouTube, but that's gonna be hard because I don't have a capture card on my Nintendo 3DS, so the quality is gonna be terrible and it's probably not gonna be super fun. But if you guys do wanna see it, let me know in the comment section below. I'll do it for you guys. I'm Daddy Gamer Fred on Instagram and Twitter. Like always, guys, you can bring the conversation there. I'm the American Gamer in Switzerland right here on YouTube. And yes, I'm gonna be doing a ton of these Pokemon ultra sun and ultra moon news update videos the best way to catch them all is with a subscription so please hit that subscribe button also hit the like button it does help me out a ton as far as growing the channel is concerned ring the bell if you want to be notified on the next time i drop a video peace i'm gonna see you guys on the next pokemon ultra sun and ultra moon news update video